The Mara Triangle is a place of outstanding beauty and tranquility, which at times seems untouched by the outside world. The combination of regular rainfall and the great variety of wild animals, which are all vital to the ecosystem, keep this environment in a peak of health. These zebra coming from Kenya's Loita Plains are the first arrivals of the huge number of animals that enter the Mara Triangle every year from different areas. It seems like every crocodile in this river has been waiting for this moment. No matter how many zebra are taken by the crocodiles, there are always many more which make it safely across. Now a second wave of animals arrive along the southern boundary. And then suddenly, here they come in their hundreds of thousands. All along the route, the predators are watching for the first sign of the approaching herds. The lion knows how dangerous the crocodile is to him. The crocodile might appear to be asleep, but it would be suicidal for the lion to cross now. More wildebeest come from afar, attracted by the sounds of the crossing. By working together, they are able to take on such a large animal. Weather can cause disruption to the best laid plans. Once they are on the move, a wildebeest just follows the one in front until thousands of animals are rushing back the way they came a few days ago. In reality, the so-called migration is not a true migration at all. The path of the wildebeest is an endless movement as they circle the Mara Serengeti ecosystem, their roots determined by where the rain falls to bring on enough grass and water to sustain them. For all we know, this very wildebeest zigzagging across the plains of the Mara Triangle today may return tomorrow. They are just one small fraction of a vast migration with no beginning and no end. <laughs>